How's it going today, everybody? Only got about an hour and a half so before dark, as you can tell from the sun setting already. I'm out here, a little spot. You've seen me here before. I did a lot of fishing at that sandbar with my daughter. Caught some pretty big carp. Got a night crawler out right now. I'm gonna throw some meps and some crankbaits to see what happens. Like I said, don't have much time. As you can tell, the sun's pretty bright already. It's getting down there. But, uh, Temperatures have warmed up, cold front's already moved on, so I'm hoping the bite picks up pretty soon here for the fall bite. If not, I guess we'll just keep struggling and see what happens. All right, see you out here. And if you're wondering, I do not have my bait caster on me because uh discovered the other day on the kayak when I took it out trolling, I have a cut eyelid in it. I was wondering why my line kept snapping. Well, I finally figured that one out. So that's got to be restrung and have to go through it to see uh, if I can find where which eyelet it is. Fortunately, I didn't find it right away, so I gotta take a quick look at it again. I wouldn't say it quick. I want to go through it and see if I can't figure out which eyelet's bad and see if I can't polish it out. Hopefully, I can. Oh, that is a fish right there. I thought I felt a little love tap, but then felt another one. First smallie of the night. Yeah, just chill, buddy, and I'll get you off, get you back. My first little guy of the night, not very big, 8, 10 incher, nice little smallie though, let this guy go. Goodbye friend. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Don't have the camera cut all that, but he jumped out of the water for it. And I lost him. Was not expecting that one bit. Came around right the rocks right there for it. There's one. That's a nice smallie. Really nice smallie. Holy smoke, that a nice smallie. How many times can you say smallie? Oof, duh. It's a hefty one. That's a really nice smallie. Thick, big mouth. Hit it nice and hard. Get a little clip of this guy real quick. Out here, throwing some baits. Kind of a cloudy day. Pulled up at nice smallie. Let this guy go. Nope. There you go. Alright, it's one nice one on the board. Was not expecting a nice one like that out of here. But I'll take it. 
Sure is a peaceful one out here tonight. It's really quiet. Usually a bunch of people on that sandbar during the week. That sandbar over there. Where I take my daughter fishing a lot. Can't believe there's no one actually there today. Finally warmed up a little bit from the last few days where it's been like in the 40s. In the 70s. I think right now though it's only like 62 I believe. Yesterday was 84. Day before that was 82. Day before that was 48. Gotta love the Midwest and the Mother Nature and not making up her mind if we're going full fall or summertime again. Alright, one more cast and I'm gonna head down to my dam. See what's going on down there. Probably gonna be a bunch of people there right now since it's so nice out, but we'll see. If it's busy there, I'll just find another spot to go to. Alrighty. Back down at my local dam. Start off with a map and see what happens if I don't lose my fitting here first. Like a big old giant dum dum. Oh, I want a fish. There's one. He hammered it. Another nice smallie. Another dandy of a smallie. That's another really nice smallie. Oh yeah, beautiful fish. All right, let's get this one back in the water. Live another day. Bye, friend. The crankbait I'm using today does not have a name on it. Got it from my cousin a long time ago. I don't know if it's a custom paint job one or what, but doesn't say anything on the bill. Nope, nothing on the bill. Nothing on the body. It's just that little guy. I think it's supposed to dive eight foot, I believe. Is my best guess. I mean, I don't know exactly. I'm just going off from the bill style. From what I've seen in the past, all my other crankbaits. Yeah, that's what I'm using tonight. That's a fish. Very settled bite. Not very big. That was a really small bite. One little dibble dabble. Oh. Another smallie. Smaller. Definitely pretty though. Goodbye, friend. A few more casts and I gotta get out of here. I get to my brother's place and take a look at his water softener for him, see if I can't fix it quick. And after that, I'll be going home and taking a shower and eating some supper. I'm getting ready for bed for work tomorrow morning. Oh, these bugs keep biting my ears. There's one.
Another smallie. That is a really pretty smallie. Holy cow. That's a really pretty one. Very pretty smallie. Goodbye, friend. Really need to start bringing rags with me. Let's just keep wiping on my sweatshirt and call it good. That was a very subtle bite on that guy too. Ah, uh, back in that snag again. Here we go. Very subtle bite in him too. Oh, another one right there. That's not too bad of a small either. Another pretty one. Not as pretty as the last one. Still fun fighting now. Bye, friend. They're all like right in here, right in front of me. All in these rocks. That's kind of common to find them. Find a good rock bottom and you're pretty much set this time of the year. All right, a couple more casts and I get out of here. I'm going to do five casts. That's number five. There's one. Oh, and he popped. Bummer. Let me take one quick look. For some baits, maybe float against some logs and rocks quick. See if I can recuperate any from all the ones I've lost recently. Way too many. Way, way too many. I found a lighter. Rusty as heck. Take that, put it on the garbage. Oh yeah, right there. Another minnow bucket. Take that. Throw it in the garbage. Up top. Oh, you want a fish? Where'd he go? I just seen him. Well, that was a bust. Bummer. Bummer. Oh well. He says they'll pick up some trash while I was out here. Oh, speaking of more trash. Alrighty. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Wasn't much. A bunch of smallies again. It's kind of common for me. Seems like I can't get away from them, but. It is what it is. They're still a blast to catch, and they're, I think, pretty beautiful fish. For being colorblind, from what I can see, I like the colors of them. Definitely better than largemouth bass. But uh, temperatures are supposed to uh, stay kind of steady for a week or two. Maybe some rain in the future. We don't know yet. They say it's supposed to, but we tend not to get it. Seems like it's one of those years. But other than that, thank you for watching, and have a great day.